What's up, pilots? Hope you're doing okay. Let's say hi to my cat. Hi, be Sabo. And I love you. I do. What's your coat? Okay. So, hope you're doing all right. Yeah, I shaved for the first time in a while. Looking more like my discount Walter White. Alter ego, so to speak. And, um... Just wanted to go ahead and read something to you here. There's an article from Tech... Tech Radar? Yeah, Tech Radar. Let's see, www.techradar.com. The Soulsborne games were the only real obstacle, quote, <coughs> preventing Armored Core 6. I just got done cooking dinner. I've been sampling it. <coughs> sampling it the whole time. And I've been having some adult drinks. So, as I get to doing this, let's go ahead and do that. There we go. Now I look like your favorite history teacher. So, <laughs> don't... <laughs> Don't laugh at me, baby. All right. I love you. I love you, too. All right. So, I'm going to read you this article. All right. Showed up in my Google feed. I figured it would be worth reading after I actually read it myself. I was like, oh, I need to let them know about that. I can't skip on this. What would I be doing? What was the whole point of me shaving my head? If not to show its glory to the world. Oh, also, I am the uh, Exiled King. This is the Armored Core Exiled channel. And, um... Do what? Nothing. Yeah, thank you, Peanut Gallery. Keep your comments to yourself. I love you, baby. Do not be eating my food, you damned heathen. I'm glad we were over a minute into the video on that one. Because YouTube was cracking down on that stuff because they're <sighs> negative Nancys. All right, so I'm old. My back is going out. I'm 31, so I'm doing that stuff. The dry skin patch is playing hell on my face. All right, so let's begin. It's been 10 years since the release of the last Armored Core game, the series that From Software was best known for before it released Dark Souls in 2011. Set in a future where great big mechs are piloted by mercenaries fighting it out in a hellscape of permanent warfare, it's hard not to get excited for Armored Core 6. However, it turns out we would have had our robot-loving hands on it sooner if it weren't for the success of the Soulsborne games. Which is acknowledging the fact that whenever From Software struck gold with, what was it, Dark Souls, I think it was? Dark Souls 1? They just took that and ran with it. They focused on that. Made a lot of money off of that. From Software finally revealed Armored Core 6 at the 2022 Game Awards after years of Soulsborne games such as Elden Ring and Dark Souls 3. Ten years after the release of Armored Core Verdict Day in 2013, it sure did take From Software a while to get back to it. And we all know how bad that's been. Because if any of you are as into Armored Core as I am, this has been a long, long dry spell. I've went without girlfriends longer than I've went without Armored Core games. And I'm not going to lie. Wait, no. No, I haven't. I've went without girlfriends in less time than I've went without Armored Core games. So it hurts that much. Also, apparently there's like a really blonde hair and it's sticking out and annoying me. I'm going to go ahead and bet that's a white hair. All right. Quote, there was never any intention to leave this large a gap between Armored Core games. End quote. Producer Yasutaka Ogoda told Haruki, Haruka Mori, my bad, I read the I on Mori uh, way too soon. Haruka Mori in an interview with BNE Fun Live. As many who worked at From Software, quote, have always wanted to create a new Armored Core title, end quote, but unfortunately, there were just a few barriers in the way. Quote, the only real obstacle was that our company always had so many different titles on the go, end quote, Ogura said. So, thanks to all those pesky, critically acclaimed Soulsborne games, yeah, they have been a nuisance, haven't they? <laughs> like they haven't made a cash cow. Did she get you? That's what you she get. She on my spot. Okay, well, that's not, that's not her problem. Ivy, don't you listen to her. She's just being a negative Nancy. Let's see. Alright, so. So thanks to all those pesky, critically acclaimed Soulsborne games, we've had to wait a decade for Armored Core 6. But I suppose that's the price you pay for Elden Ring, Bloodborne, and the like. Which is true. For such good games from, from software, we did pay a hefty price. What can we expect? Put any dreams of a Soulsborne take on mechs in a box, however. Quote. 
We've not been making a conscious effort to try to direct Armored Core 6 towards more Soulsborne type gameplay and quote executive director Hidetaka Miyazaki told IGN. Yes you did and I'm glad you did. Because we need people that are new to the games to understand that this is not a Soulsborne. This is giant robots where you fly around a bit and then you go bang bang slice slice. That's how this works. You know, you got to get lock on. You got to worry about FCS. You got to worry about EMC. What is it? EMC or ECM? Yeah, ECM. Electronic countermeasures. Yeah. See, I'm I'm getting old. See the white streaks in my beard? Yeah, that's a lot of white hairs. I shaved even more off my head today. Good God! All right. <laughs> Don't you say nothing. Peanut gallery doesn't talk. You're in the cheap seats. Enjoy it. You were even letting the stadium. Be happy. <laughs> I mean, at least you don't have a green as Matt does. I mean, yeah. That poor bastard. He's got a lot of gray. A lot mm -hmm. of gray. I've got solid whites. I've got quality. He's got quantity. <sighs> a friend of mine has a lot of gray hair. I've got solid whites. I don't have many. I don't have pretty much any grays, but I've got definite solid whites. God, do I have solid whites? I get right to the point. All right. Plunge into some sort of mechanical apocalyptic world, this sci-fi action RPG sets you up as a mercenary who completes tasks for various corporate benefactors as a silent protagonist. These missions are varied and could entail protection and escort duties or mass destruction jobs where you play through waves... Really? Plow? Plow, not play. Plow through waves of smaller mechs. However, the assignments themselves aren't necessarily important. It's the money you get at the end of these tasks that count. It sounds like a 9 to 5, I'm not going to lie. A basic job. By collecting your cash rewards, you can work towards customizing your mech in greater detail. Because your grammar is terrible, let me correct it for you, Tech Radar. Alright, anyway, greater, they said great. I say greater, detail. The Armored Core itself can become an extension of the player thanks to the hundreds of customizations you forgot of, options, and upgrades. This is one of the main attractions of the series as a whole, which is correct. While From Software will hopefully stay true to this characteristic, it may also take inspiration from what it has learned from producing its Soulsborne titles. Quote, We were determined to take advantage of From Software's experience and know-how to establish freedom for the player in terms of what can be done with game controls and the customization that lies at the series core, end quote, Ogura said. We could see this inspiration come to life. Oh, fuck you twice. That's, alright, look. I'm not read... Recording this, you get the one. I don't care who Ellie is. Thank you, Ellie, for your article. All right. I didn't mean to drop the F bomb, but I accidentally hit a link. And that's just kind of how it went. Yeah. Okay. So. Blah, blah, blah. One of the main attractions of the series as a whole. While from software will hopefully stay true to this characteristic, it may also take inspiration from what it has learned from producing its Soulsborne titles. We were determined to take advantage of the experience. Blah, 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 blah. Series core. Customization lies at the series core. I'll go to sad. Okay. We could see this inspiration, inspiration come to life from the boss fights. Quote, I think players will be very pleased by the in, or with the intensity of the boss battles. I'll go to sad. By employing many of the same techniques that have been successful in the past from software games. End quote. While I probably won't get a full futuristic Soulsborne game filled with high-tech mechs and brilliantly destructive guns, I'll settle with having the rabbit and intense boss fights and I'm familiar with. And then Ellie Gold is the featured writer. So, thank you, Ellie. I appreciate the article from Tech Radar. You are delightful. I'm hoping that you do well. To those of you who are listening with virgin ears, I do apologize for the F-bomb. However, you've got to understand, I am very tired. It's the end of the day. And I just kind of responded. Because I'm human. Anyway, hope you're doing well. Hope you enjoyed this. I'm excited. I'm looking forward to this. And the more of my debt that I pay off, the closer I get to paying that off, and the closer my taxes get to hitting, the sooner I can get me an Xbox One S, and I can go ham on this like I mean it. So, I'm excited for that. I'm going to need all of you to go ahead and just... Drop a subscribe on here if you haven't already. I need you to subscribe. Drop a like if you haven't. Drop a comment down below. Let me know what you're expecting for this. How excited you are. What it is that your first Armored Core game was. What exposed you to this franchise. And what it is that you love the most about this franchise. Because I'm curious. I love to hear from you all. You're absolutely the heart 
and soul of this channel. I love you 100%. And I can't wait to get back to making videos for this. And I really need to take a day off and actually try to see if the programs all work on your computer. I really do. Because it is killing me that I'm not making stuff. Anyway, I work a lot, so there you go. OT, where you be? Overtime is great, but I need a lot of it. A lot. Like 20 plus hours of overtime if I can get it. Anyway, love you all. Hope you're doing all right. And uh, if you haven't yet, hit that bell icon for notifications whenever I do upload. Unfortunately, they were sparse, but again, I work a lot. I'm very busy on my days off. My days off aren't actually days off because I'm having to work full time. I don't get to do this full time as much as I wish that I could. It took me, what, 15 years? Whenever I first started playing Armored Core 3 back in the day, it took me 15 years to finally be able to actually do this and to have any kind of a subscriber base. So I'm grateful to each and every one of you. I love you all dearly. Hope you're doing all right. Hope you had a good New Year's. And uh, if any of you noticed, I spent mine a little bit tipsy, a little bit buzzed. And I'm definitely hoping that we can all move forward and have a wonderful time in this year. I wish you all the best. I wish you all love and light. I know it's some hippy dippy sort of stuff, but I mean, what would I be if not somebody who cares about you? Because you have given me your time, your subscription, your comments, your likes, and I absolutely love you. Some of you have actually sent me a lot of like support whenever I needed it the most, and I absolutely appreciate you. You know who you are, and I am grateful to you every single day. You have no idea. My cat is happy, unhealthy, and asleep on some of my hats right now. God, she's so cute. Let's see if I can show you real quick. Ivy, are you grateful? Yeah. You're so cute. Anyway. Back to me. I'm seriously grateful for you, though. Because if not for you, then I wouldn't be where I am right now. You have no idea how much I appreciate that. But if any of you find yourselves... Yeah, look at that. Look at that. Like the brick blood red and like the navy blue i dig it anyway if any of you are finding yourself able or would like to have me get my laptop back which is 458 dollars any pennies you can throw my way any financial support you can give me i would greatly appreciate it if you can do so via cash app or paypal i'd be grateful you get a shout out if you want it i'll even work you into my project somehow i'll find a way so whether it be the written story, which is going to be a lot different than the videos, or the videos I'm going to work on once I actually have my laptop back. So, nice, baby. I give that one like a 4 out of 10. Low end of this. That one's more like a 6 or 7 out of 10. That was pretty good. That was pretty good. I give you that. Thank you. I like the grade burps. Anyway, <laughs> as soon as I get my laptop back, there's a written version that I'm going to be writing a story called The Project I've been working on for a long time. Way too long. And a video version that is just a spin of the... A new telling of the Armored Core for Answer story. So if you want to help me, I'd be grateful. I need my laptop back, though. I've got the mic and everything else. I just need the laptop. If you can help me with that, Cash App and PayPal. The Cash App and PayPal are in the description. But I'll go ahead and say them here for the sake of actually saying it. Cash App is Cash Tag Discount Walter White. All one word. In case you didn't notice, look up Walter White Wrecking Bad. You'll see it. Anyway, <laughs> the PayPal is going to be at Insoa117, the at symbol, I-N-S-O-A-117. Don't mimic me. Don't do that. I'm, I haven't memorized my heart. I love you. I love you. I love you so much. I love you so much. Aww. And if you can, find your girl that loves you as much as mine loves me. I adore her. She's so cute. I love her. She's so sweet. She's gonna cry. Aww. I love you, baby. Oh, God damn it. She's crying. Oh, it's so easy. <laughs> but no, I love you guys. And I love you, baby. Thank you for being so supportive of me. You have no idea how much it means to me. I'm gonna go eat dinner and watch some animus. I love you. And I can't wait to see you guys out there. I'm so excited. One way or the other, we're going to find a way to be all out there. I wish we could do it Armored Core Verdict Day style, but we've already had confirmation that it is not going to be that big of a scale. 
but that's okay. I'll see you all out there. Stay frosty, pilots.